Hey guys, welcome to Maverick Meteor. Today I want to show you how I carve a pumpkin and some of my favorite tools. I start with a pumpkin with good thick walls and I can tell that by thumping on the side and by the weight. If the walls are thick, the pumpkin will be pretty heavy. These are some of the tools I use to get started. This is a basic clay loop, but I've sharpened this side to make it easier to cut through the pumpkin. The small loop at the bottom is great for details, and the flat side is perfect for smoothing. This is a larger ribbon that I made myself from flat steel. One side is sharpened, and it's perfect for removing the skin or sculpting large areas. The last item is a solid graphite pencil. It's very soft, which makes it easy to draw on the pumpkin, but also easy to wipe off later. <coughs> I found this tool at a local craft store. It's my favorite detail tool. One end has a long arrowhead point and the other is a pointed scoop. It's razor sharp and perfect for fine details on areas like the eyes or teeth. Sometimes I use more specialized tools like this Exacto V gouge. I use it to carve hair or other fine details. It's called a V gouge because it's literally shaped like the letter V and it cuts a perfect V shaped channel. And there he is, a scary ogre ready for Halloween. His eyes and teeth are made of potatoes. It helps him look a little more lifelike. Unfortunately, all ogre pumpkins eventually go bad, and they need to be disposed of properly before they become dangerous. I usually hire a ninja to sneak up and neutralize the ogre. Then, I wait for the natural predator of the pumpkin ogre, deer. Deer can smell a pumpkin ogre from miles away. They may look innocent, but don't be fooled. They can devour an ogre pumpkin in minutes. The deer will approach cautiously at first to be sure there's no danger. Once they taste the pumpkin flesh, they will swarm in a frenzy until every last bit of pumpkin is eaten. I hope you enjoyed watching me carve the ogre, and I hope you enjoy carving your pumpkins this year. 
If you had fun watching, don't forget to like and subscribe. Happy Halloween!